Hello and happy holidays from Blues Domino. Just wanted to do a little update for you. I'm going to do a little bit of a review, do another string test. Uh, this time I'll be using my 2014 Fender Telecaster. This is the one with the uh, sandblasted finish in blue. It's one of 250. Uh, just kind of my go-to guitar for noodling around and coming up with new stuff. And I absolutely love this guitar. So, a couple of things that I've done. Uh, I've got this guitar running right now, uh, as I usually do, in kind of stereo through my pedal board and out to my Fender Blues Junior and my Fender Hot Rod Deluxe. And uh, recently just did a, uh, one of the preamp tubes, switched out one of the 12AX7s to a 12AT7, and I've been pretty satisfied with that. Kind of gets the volume back under control, so I can get some nice tone without blaring out the neighbors or the wife or the like. Um, so right now I've got the 10 through 46 Diodaro nickel wound XLs. Um, you know, kind of the blue label with the orange circle around it. In fact, uh, we'll show it to you. It's just right here. It's a 10 through 46, the EXL 110s. It's been a great set of strings. It's lasted a good uh, eight plus months. And, um, you know, I play every day, not a gigging musician by any means, more of a hobbyist. And I know I'm a little late to the party, but I'm going to try a set of these, the Diodaro NYXLs. Same string gauge, the 10 through 46, and just want to do a comparison of what the tone sounds like. Uh, I know it's not a real fair comparison right now because these strings have had a lot of life on them, but I'll uh, do a little noodling around and we'll pause the video and start it back up with a new set of strings. So here you go. <laughs> Man, these things are punchy. They've got some uh, definite bite. And you see they're 6% stronger, and you got a little bit more output there. So let's have a listen to that. <laughs> Okay, so as you can hear, nice and chimey and full and warm, all of the tonal goodness that we all like in a nice set of strings. Didario has really uh, kind of, I think, set the standard in getting kind of that right blend of uh, a string that's got enough uh, attack to it that's not over the top. Uh, played some of the, like the Ernie Ball Cobalts and that, and those things are just a little too heavy and abrasive in the feel of the wound string. Uh, this has got a little bit more bite than the nickel wound Didaro XLs. Um, you know, those strings are great. Uh, this gives you more punch and a little bit more volume and tone, like uh, a lot of those new, uh, you know, new styled strings that have different alloy blends. Uh, you know, this, uh, 
this string. I just I really kind of am going to enjoy this one. I think uh, you know if I could get a hybrid between the NYXL and get some of the uh, flat wound chromes, uh, kind of meld those two strings together. I think that would be the ideally perfect string for me and what I like. So uh, anyway, uh, here's Blues Domino. It'll play out a little bit. Uh, you guys keep on playing on, and I hope you enjoy the videos. And you can um, give me some comments in the bottom there and like it and share it with all your friends. But the big thing is let's just uh, keep on rocking on and having some uh, great picking and enjoying. So with that... Uh, Blues Domino out. Enjoy. Mm -hmm.